So as an example, let's have a look at DTMF frequencies. And let's assume a sampling rate of one kilohertz. Let's choose two DTMF frequencies. So one, 1,209 hertz, and the other frequency, 770 hertz. So it makes this clear. So now let's go back to our diagram here. Yeah, so we've got our frequency mapping here. Yeah, so these are our F analog, and this is here our F digital. So then we have here FS half, and this is FS. So our FS in this case here is one kilohertz. So this means this frequency is somewhere sitting here. Yeah, so. So that's our 1,209 Hz. And the other frequency here, the 770, let's say this is roughly sitting here. So that's our 770 Hz. So we see here we're getting these two kinds of mappings here. So the 1,209 Hz is easy to calculate here, so we're just subtracting our sampling rate in this case here and getting 209 hertz out there. So with the 770 hertz here, this is on the on this um, negative slope here, so in order to get this one here, we need to do this one, um, in order to get this one here, we need to do sampling rate fs minus 770 hertz. So this gives us here 230 hertz. Yeah, so, so this DTMF frequency maps onto 230 hertz, and this DTMF frequency maps onto 209 hertz.